Kenya Editors Guild, KEG, together with the Kenya Union of Journalists, KUJ, and other media stakeholders early Wednesday, led their counterparts from various media stations in Nairobi to display their frustrations against police brutality during the month-long Gen Z's protests. The messengers submitted petitions to the police headquarters before marching to Parliament during the peaceful demos that saw police officers offering security. Mike Kagongo reports. This was the real situation at the Nairobi Central Business District Wednesday. <laughs> Using placards and a strong desire for justice for their injured colleagues. The media professionals made their way along the city's main streets, castigating the disciplined forces. The shooting of Nakuru journalist Catherine Wanjeri Karioki by police last week while covering anti-government protests and the daylight abduction of veteran journalist Mashari Gaido on July 17th served as the catalyst for the demonstrations. Nafikiri serikali iwape waandisho habari uhuru wao. Kwa sababu angalau imethibitishwa ama imeandikwa kwenye katiba kwamba vyombo vya habari nchini vina uhuru wake lakini uhuru huo unaona unafinywa na serikali our democracy can only be as strong as the media industry is here in Kenya in fact this is not a protest about media personalities it should be a nationwide protest by every other citizen because they cannot do what we do we do it on their behalf and in trust and we have not had any time when we've been told that we have broken any types of laws they sent a clear message enough is enough requesting the acting inspector general of police Douglas Kanja to take decisive action against implicated police officers or else we are telling them that no to media censorship we do not want to see also media being censored all the time we do not want a situation where government goes without paying the media its dues we want our rights and freedoms as enshrined under article 34 of the constitution tunadai haki kama vyombo vya habari kwa sababu sasa tunatishiwa kwamba vyombo vyetu vya habari vitavamiwa sasa hivi tunaitwa genocide media kwa kufanya kazi yetu kwa nini tunaitwa genocide media the ig is not in office uh, now but uh, the petition has arrived and also to just to reassure the media that as the national police service we, this is we work together the speaker of the national assembly moses wetangula was strongly urged by the angry scribes to preserve journalistic freedom and abstain from discrimination this is in response to parliamentary restrictions prohibiting some media professionals from covering events in parliament in the wake of the june 25th invasion of the august house by gen z's interestingly there was a great degree of composure throughout the demonstrations with police supplying security rather than using tear gas as was the case with tuesday's gen z protests mike kagwongo tv 47 nairobi